Sam here from the National Electronics Museum. Today we're going to be talking about our rotating copper disc demo here. And what we have is batteries attached to a small motor, and that's actually going to power on our rotating copper disc, as you can see. Now we know that copper is a conductor of electricity, um, but it's also not magnetic. So what we're going to do with this demo is test out what happens when I turn on the motor. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn on the, uh, the, the motor. It's going to, the copper disc is going to start spinning, and then I'm going to take my wheel of magnets here, and we're going to see how the magnets and the copper disc how they interact. So you can see it kind of it slows down the copper disc at the same time the wheel of magnets is spinning. Eddy currents are induced by changing magnetic fields and created when a conductor is moving through a magnetic field. The eddy currents in the copper disc interact with the magnetic fields from the magnets, causing the disc to slow. Okay, so for the second element of this demo, what we have here is this device, and it actually has two magnets on each side. So we're going to see what happens when I turn on the demo and actually inch it toward the rotating copper disc. So you can see that it actually slows down, even stops the rotating copper disc. That's because the eddy currents are actually produced on each side of the disc, causing a braking action. Now we can see this same thing happen in uh, roller coasters. They use magnetic braking so that there's no wear and tear of the brakes. But they can actually slow down those roller coaster cars uh, easily using the same technology of eddy currents. Thank you.